Hi, this is Adam with the Flute Corporation. Uh, today I'm here at Test Equipment Depot and we're here to talk about the new Fluke Network's Link IQ Industrial Ethernet Cable and Network Tester. Uh, so this, this tool is going to allow technicians to solve the number one cause of industrial Ethernet failures, which is typically the cable itself. Um, it's going to enable you to validate cable performance. You can measure up to 100 feet and measure up to 10 gigabits per second uh, speed. Um, you can identify miswired and split pairs in terminated cables. You can um, get switch information, uh, which is also very important. And you can install and troubleshoot uh, power over Ethernet uh, devices uh, using a tool like this and document everything using the Linkware PC. So next up, we're going to do a quick, uh, quick couple of tests and an unboxing just to show you guys a little bit more about the uh, Link IQ. So now we're going to talk about the Link IQ and what comes in the box. So you'll see that we have the uh, canvas carrying case, We've got the Link IQ unit itself. It also comes with a remote ID tag, so this allows you to connect this to the other end of a cable um, or to a network to verify basically what you're looking at, what you're connected to. Uh, USB cable for downloading to your PC so that you can download your results uh, from Link IQ into Linkware PC. And what we're going to do real quick is we have a we have an RJ45 patch cable that we're just going to really just uh, we're going to go through and do a real quick uh, pass fail test on this right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my remote ID and I'm going to put it into the coupler here. I'm going to attach this end to one end of this cable and I'm going to attach the other end to the Link IQ and I'm going to hit auto test. And almost instantaneously, this has told me a lot of information about the cable itself. This has told me I've got five feet of cable, uh, my pin configuration, uh, which remote ID I have connected to the end, and it also gives me a speed check. Uh, I'm going to go through and actually show you what a faulty cable might look like if you were running a test. Uh, you can also set the, you can do a pass fail setting as well, so if you want network is limited, you can also um, set limitations on the speed. You can also save it. In this case, I'm not going to save it. I'm going to exit without saving. So I'm going to do a quick switch over. So now I'm going to connect this to a cable with a known fault in it. What I've done is I've just created a little bit of an issue here. Uh, it's a a little bit of an exaggeration is what you might see, but to give you an idea, I've done the same thing. I've just plugged the remote ID into the end of this cable, and I'm going to go ahead and auto test. So that cable has obviously failed. It's told me that at one foot, there's a fault, and it also tells me exactly which twisted pair is broken. And it's not able to get me a speed check because the cable's not, not functioning properly. So. Really, really quickly, you can connect to uh, cables, networks, and determine the root cause of, of many of the issues that you might see in an industrial environment. For more information on the Link IQ cable tester, please visit testequipmentdepot.com. I'm Adam with Fluke. Thanks again for watching.